Scenario, payment approval. Cronus International currently has no control over their payment approval process. Payments are being processed without any approval and the company has major cash flow issues. A process needs to be enforced where payments over $1,000 cannot be posted until checked by account manager or treasurer. The process flow diagram. If a payment journal is entered more than $1,000, the first check is, is it a currency payment? If it is a currency payment, it is directed to the treasurer for approval. If it isn't a currency payment, it is a local payment, then it is directed to the account manager for approval. If either of these two people reject the payment, then the accounts are notified of this rejection. If they approve the payment, then accounts are notified of the approval. Translated into Aguilas workflow, the condition is that a payment is entered more than $1,000 and that will trigger the payment authorization workflow, which the first step will actually be a field modification. A gearless workflow will automatically move the payment journal to on hold. Then the first to do is to approve the payment. And a gearless workflow will look at whether it's a currency payment or not, and it will automatically work out who is the right person to forward this to do to. If the payment is rejected, then Annette will be notified of this rejection. And if the payment is accepted and approved, Annette will be notified of the approval and the field modification, Aguilas workflow will automatically move the on hold field to blank and take it off hold. Annette Hill has entered in a payment journal and it's triggered the payment authorization workflow. It was in the local currency, so that means that Agilis Workflow has automatically worked out that this approval is for Jeff. Here I've logged in as Jeff, and if I look into my now to-dos, I have a new approve payment to-do. I can have a look at the details of the payment by going to the assign to, and once I'm happy with that, I can actually go and edit this to-do and say whether I approve it or I reject it. In this case I'm approving it so I select that one and my to-do is updated. At this point Annette is now notified that the approval has been made. Cash is flowing once again at Cronus International. The payment process is now tightly controlled and no incorrect payments are slipping through. Harry now has control over the treasury and Jeff is no longer getting in trouble. Annette is also actually enjoying the structured process as she can no longer be blamed for posting incorrect payments.